Hello. Hello, Incredible Noble. How are you? Good afternoon. This is Dr. Kemi Olunoyo, investigative journalist. How are you? I'm fine, I'm right now. Okay, it's like 12.38 p.m. I just messaged you and I told you to send me your number. I want to, I want to interview you on what happened. I just saw all these videos everywhere. Are you willing to talk to me? I am, it's fine, yeah. Okay, let me put you on the record. You know what that means? I'm recording you. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, I know. I'm Kemi Olunloya, Dr. Kemi Olunloya. I'm an investigative journalist. I'm sure you know me. I was reviewing the news wires this morning when I saw my colleagues as Sahara reporters with a video showing that the police came to your house and there was some kind of scuffle on they wanted to arrest people in your house and all yeah. that stuff. Now, the video disturbed me and I wanted to talk to you because basically this is a short interview. I just want to hear your side of the story, but I do want to tell you what I've done. I called Kunle Adishebutu. Kunle Adishebutu is a very good cop, but he is also, um, I've been working with him for a long time. He's a police spokesman in many states. He has been the police spokesman in my state or your state. That's how I met him. He is now the new PPRO for Lagos State Police, um, headed by Mr. Akimo Dumosu. So I called Kunle this morning as I saw the video. I would say it's 12.39 now. I would say I called Kunle around 11.15. And he was not aware of what happened. And as a police spokesman and something trending online, you know, he has to find out. So he asked me to send him the video. I did. And he said he would get back to me. So while he's getting back to me, you know, they have to find out what happened. They have to find oh. out the police station, where the police officers came from, what happened, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. That could take days. Now, the mainstream media is the one supposed to be doing all the stuff I'm doing now, but nobody has really oh. brought it up. Okay, nobody has brought it up because a lot of times some people feel that, oh, those boys are criminals, they might be Yahoo boys, blah, blah, blah. I'm doing my work. Tell me what happened. When did, when did this happen? It happened yesterday, man. Yesterday. yesterday. What after, time? Do you know? Um, after, when did we order for the food? So like food time. In the afternoon? In the afternoon, yes, man. And where were you? In your house? I was, yes, I was inside. Okay, so how did it all happen? Somebody knocked at the door. Tell me, just tell us. All right, my, my cinematographer um, actually ordered for a food online. Mm -hmm. Then he, 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 told, he, he told one of my guys to go outside and pick the food for him. Mm -hmm. So when those when my guys went out to go to go carry the food, that's when the, this uh, police officer grabbed them and said, um, "You are a foster." He, first, first of all, the only police officer showed them the gun and said, "Don't don't talk anything too much. Don't talk too much about you are a foster." Just approached the guy and told him you are a foster. The guy said, "No, I'm a reporter now. Uh, my my boss was inside, which is me." Then, I, I don't know what was going on inside a, a gunshot. They took one of, the, one of my guys inside the, the Fianaka, while the second one is trying to explain himself. The first one is, is, is afraid. Okay, speak so, slowly. Speak slowly. They went to get food outside, right? Yeah, they went And to police get, just picked them and said, you are fraudsters. Yeah, yeah. If we first of all showed them, he's gone. I said, they should don't talk, say, yeah, don't talk anything more. Don't Threaten talk. them with his gun, right? He's gone, yeah, yes. Hmm. And, he, and he said to me that you're a foster. And the guy replied him and said, um, boss man, I'm a foster, I'm just an entertainer. So from there, he, he told them, yeah, just enter the car. Why the second one refused to enter? He said, ah, my boss is inside the house, which is me. Then, when, when uh, the officer was trying to, like, enter my force, then the guy was trying to force and said that he wants to enter the gate and say, say for him that, yeah, this was happening outside. Mm -hmm. Then the, the man was trying to, I uh, drag with him the gate. It was trying to open it. My offense is like dragging back. So I can enter the, your car. So he just shouted my name. Then I, I came out. But as I was coming out, I had a gun shot again. The man shot they fired twice. shots? Yeah, the man shot twice. In the air? In the air, yes, man. Oh my God. To, to scare the, the, the guy so he can follow them. Mm -hmm. so as, I, as I came outside, I saw the man doing the one was dragging him. Then I, I'll be like, what happened? What happened? Talk to me, what happened? Then the man said, these people here yeah, had the evidence to be using iPhone X at this stage, blah, 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 blah. So he said, um, they, they must enter the car and they must follow them to that police station. And I said, why, 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 why is your arrest warrant? And why, 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 okay, now, imagine me seeing you now because you are holding gun and say you are, you are mobile. You are not, you are not uniform. I, I told the man everything. And the man said, no, that's why he's going there. They must follow him. Then I started arguing with him. The country what do you think? So you fought them and they could not arrest the guys. Did they, did they yeah. have... Did they arrest them? No, no, no. They didn't, I don't, I don't, I don't you fought them. Guys. Yeah, yeah. And they I left. Them. 
Yeah, yeah, they left. Yes, they left. Why did they leave? Was there a crowd there waiting to attack them or something? No, 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 no one was waiting to attack them. It was just me and some of my team members. Right? They just abandoned the whole thing. Yeah, they just abandoned and they left. Okay, I'm investigating that. Okay, the police department is going to investigate that. Like I said, I've only spoken to the PPRO, Mr. Kunle Adishibutu. CSP Adishibutu is going to find out and get to the bottom of it. And hopefully he'll get, me, get back to me within the next 48 hours. But you have told me your story. That's what I want to hear. Everything was unprovoked. Police was just outside. Yeah, there are people who have called me and told me that there are quarters in the police department. We know about that. Go out and arrest 10 people today. Go out and arrest. We cannot afford profiling. This is what's happening. This is a big story. You may not even know, but it's coming out to me now, and I'm exclusively interviewing you before anybody. That, that way I can get both sides of the story. Is there anything uh, else you want to tell me? Um, what happened is, as, um, I was, I was, uh, as Amanda showed me your ID cards, yeah. Yeah. He told me that he has shown my guys already that I don't need to show me again. So I refused that. I want to see his ID card. Yeah. I saw his ID card. His ID card. Mm-hmm. He's a police officer. Mm-hmm. Then I'd be like, why do you look at Kali Kakao? Who gives and say you guys are your boys? Why? All these things. I just questioned them. And then I refused to talk anything. There are a lot of coordinated rapes going on in the city. There are real criminals out there, but I wanted to know that. No, this is not what happened. That's what we're trying to stop. We're trying to end any kind of profiling, any kind of, you know, pe labeling people Yahoo boys and all that. But they have to have ID, you know. So they just basically left. And who filmed the video? Ma? Ma? Who filmed that video? I was the one. Like, I was the one. Because so you I, sent it You sent it to Sahara reporters? No, no, no. I just posted the video yesterday. Okay. Yesterday and Sahara and everybody else picked it up. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of calls too, you know, and I went to watch the video on Insta blog. It's everywhere. It's, it's actually gone viral around the world, it's all over the world. You know, people in London and America are calling me too. They're DMing me and all that. Okay, what's your real name? What's your real full name? Incredible. Name is, um, Omotade Solomon Damilari. The police officer asked me. Your last name is Omotade? Ma'am? What's your last name, Omotade? My last name is Yes, Omotade. Omotade. So, Jerry Solomon Omotade is your name? Yeah. Okay. Omotade is Solomon Damilari. And your, um, your, um, your stage name is Incredible Noble, and you're a comedian. Yeah, I'm a dancer and a comedian, yeah. Dancer and com Instagram comedian, right? Yes, yes. yes Do you feel what you did yesterday was heroic? Mom? Do you feel what you did yesterday was heroic? heroic? Sorry, that this is hard. I, I know I thought. Let me make it easier. Do you feel you were a hero yesterday for what you did? No, I was just fighting for my rights. I, I, I didn't tell anybody I'm doing. You're fighting for your rights and the rights of others. Okay. Because, no, sorry. Mm -hmm. Because if, uh, if um, the guy talks out my name, you know, no one will have to. They will have taken my guys away and they will accuse them of harassing. Okay, then they will have to pay for bail and everything, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. This is what we're trying to stop. We want to know what's behind it. I'm going to continue investigating, but I want to thank you for talking to me today. Incredible, noble. No, Kemi Olunla, investigative journalist. Time now is 12.47 p.m. And today is uh, the 18th, Wednesday, the 18th of August, 2021. What happened? Do you know that? Who what happened? What happened? You went to I'm camera. Yes, off the camera. What happened? I'm not going to drop it. No. Drop the camera. What happened? Hey, smash my guy. Stop. Stop. Leave me now. I'll write the video. I'll write the video. I'll write the video. Stop. I'll write the video. See my guy. See my guy. See my guy. Go down, you mad. Go down! Get out! For what thing? Eh? You can't shoot me or that. Go down, you foolish! You can't go down! Pass the sound, go down! Be bold enough! See, see! You didn't do anything! You just carry my gun from my house! Where's the tenner?
You don't do anything when our house. We ask for my for movie shoots. Your kind of my guys. It is in this phone. Where's the phone? They all call him my Sir, where's the phone? Sir, where's the phone? Be man. For what? For all these little girls. Don't stop my camera. I'm ready to video. I'm ready to video. So if no one's at home, that's why they carry the boy and take him away. Sir, come and investigate. It's correct arrest warrant. Come and investigate my house. We don't do fraud. We are entertainer. No one can them in. How do you want to do fraud? You just see his phone and put it inside car and say they should follow you to anywhere. Stop, leave no bar. It's here now. Ah. Why would they shoot gun? Why would they even shoot gun? Why would they even shoot gun? If you kill me now, even though you won't run, why would you run? Why do you enter the car in the first place? You never entered. Because that's where you're right. I'm going to lie, Bumu. I'm going to go inside. Sir, not to be happen. We don't do fraud. Not to happen, sir. Not to do. Not to be happen. Who has ever asked anybody of fraud? Why you put this like that? Police cannot work. Why you put this like that? Wait. You have arrest warrants. No. You have arrest warrants. No. Just come. Very bad. Why am I there for ten years? You shot me. I don't shoot. I don't shoot. That's why I came outside.